love like you ain't never seen it before. Spy on a date with the Hold Up TV. Well, officially, hello and welcome in. My name is Dr. Love Hands, and I love to put hands on those I love. And I am here tonight with my two contestants. If This is a rematch, folks, for two of the smoothest motherfuckers to come on Spy of the Day. It is uh, <coughs> Carmen the Savage versus Mantis the Prey. And uh, if you do not remember what happened last time, there was some controversy because it was the first tie of the show. But let me just go ahead and allow my contestants to introduce themselves. Let's start with the ever so lovely Mantis. Yo, uh, I'm that motherfucker, you know. Yo, shout outs to my baby Carmelita. <laughs> and and then uh, let, let me have my second contestant, the uh, the magnificently powerful Carmen. Say hello to the people, Carmen. Uh oh, Carmen's mic is muted. Let me. Uh... <laughs> hola, hola. Hope you guys are having a wonderful evening. I'm glad you guys are here. A woman. <laughs> the spy on a date. Oh, you're just gonna have a wonderful show. I'm gonna tell you that. All right. So y'all know how this goes. Shout out to everyone on Green Room. But first, some administrative stuff. Hello, Nelly. Welcome in. We are on the march to affiliate over at the Hold Up TV Incorporated National First Baptist Church of Parochial Street. And uh, if you click that Twitch link, you can get in early to early access. You can also watch the contestants go head to head uh, tonight by coming over to the Twitch side. So thank you so much. Uh, let's get the 50 fans on the Hold Up TV and I will just go ahead and uh, I'm going to step back and we will go through our normal process. Tonight, there will be no curveballs. This is an all out war, ladies and gentlemen. These two will have four criteria. We will do exactly five minutes of small talk and we will gauge the small talk between them as per usual. And then we will go into no holds bar flirting, right? That will be the next portion no holds bar flirting. Then we will go into rapid insults about the first date so that we will give that person a chance to speak oh, and insult the other person. And then finally, we will have everyone's favorite segment, Close the Deal. My manager, Public Friend, is in the house tonight. And Public has recently paroled from Folsom. So uh, do not test Public's gangster or you will get the yeet yeet out of the greet yeet. Uh, Public will also be uh, tabulating any... Um, you know, votes and such things. So are you, um, are my contestants ready? You know it, baby. All right. So we got this right. First, we're going to start with small talk. <laughs> small talk. What's then we're going to do flirting, right? Then we're going to do insults. And then we're going to do closing the deal. So as soon as I leave and you hear the music, you know it's time to rumble. All right. <laughs> yeah, okay. Here we go. Hi. Hi, you look lovely tonight. Oh, you look you very wore handsome. makeup this time. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> well, Not you know, because of the date. <laughs> yes, it's, well, it's lovely. It's lovely. <laughs> um, how you been? How was your day? Uh, my day was a day. How was your day? Uh, it was busy. Yo, you believe in aliens? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. I, I, I don't know. Probably you don't yes. Think about you don't think you don't sit up at night, look up at the stars. Other than thinking of me, do you ever think about like, are there aliens out there? Are they willing to bang? You know, shit like that. I mean, sometimes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I take that as a no. Okay, I feel you. I, feel you. <laughs> I mean, like. If you're into that, that's that's nice to know. So when you're lying awake at night thinking about shit, what are you thinking about? Late at night? Late at night. You're lying in bed. I'll probably be asleep by then. <laughs> I mean, before um, you go to the moment before you go to sleep. Oh, before girl. I go to sleep. Hey, come on. 
<laughs> I mean, are you asking? Do I think about you before I go to sleep? Is that I'm what asking you're what you think? You know what? Let's let's change subjects. So what's oh, okay. your favorite sports team. <laughs> okay. You like, um, you like sports? I I actually do. I like watching UFC, boxing. Yeah. Oh, that's right. We talked about UFC before. Yeah. You just like watching motherfuckers beat each other. Yeah, I like that. So yeah. would it impress you if I took you out and I got into a fight with a motherfucker and knocked him right out in front of you? Um, I don't think I will. <laughs> no. I see your smile. I know it would, but... No, me, I would be like, what's going on? Why is he beating this guy up? Should I be concerned? Because I'm a real I'm man. Okay, that's the real answer. I'm a real man. I mean, it depends what the guy did. Probably that he insulted you, or maybe he insulted me. No, he was me. just looking stupid. He had like a stupid face or some shit. But why are you gonna beat him up? Maybe, maybe he, he said stupid. hi to you. You know, I don't like that. I don't like that when motherfuckers say hi to you. Oh, no, I wouldn't like that either. Oh, you don't like you don't like the possessive type. You don't like people who are crazy possessive. I mean, like. If she's winking at you, then we're probably gonna fight. I'd be okay, like, "There we go, there we go. We all have it in us. So just admit it, girl." I'd <laughs> be like, "Oh, this is my dude. Why are you looking at him? You want to? You want to fight?" We're going through this whole activity we're going through. It's about letting it all out. Just let it out, girl. Be yourself. Yeah. You like? Pull, you're gonna pull her hair? Probably. Tell me, what else would you do to her? No, I don't like. I don't like doing all that uh, <laughs> grabbing hair and scratching. We're gonna fight like mans. We're gonna, oh, you're gonna fight like mans. Okay. Yeah. You got a mean right hook. Yeah, exactly. All that. No, we're not gonna be scratching or pulling hair. I'll give you a good fight, for sure. I'd be. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't turned on right now. Who you? Yeah. <laughs> so why? Girl fights, baby. Girl fights. Oh, girl That's what that's nice. So you like looking at you like looking at girls in bikini. What is that? Uh, Who doesn't like looking at that? But what is that guy? I went blank. I'm sorry. Apologies. Oh no, it's all good. So how was your day? What you been up to? Uh, it was good. It was busy. My daughter was sick. I had to take her. I had to take her to her um, doctor's appointment. She didn't even went to school today. Came home, disappearance, wash clean. Yeah. Sounds like fun. It, it, it was fun. You know, I think my favorite part of the day is when I'm about to eat lunch. I think that's just makes me happy because I don't like being grumpy, like out, out of the day. Because then I get really upset and I'll be like, huh, I'm upset because I haven't ate. So I think that's the best part of my day when I'm eating something. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're all about the tacos, yo. Yeah. Like last time we chilled, I was like, yo, she really likes tacos, man. Yes, like, I do. She, when it was time to flirt, you were like mixing tacos into the flirtation. <laughs> I'm like, damn, does she want me or does she want the taco? <laughs> well, I, I guess I know where we're going when we finally meet up. Where are we going? To whatever local taco place there is. Oh yeah, <laughs> has to be a food truck there. Make sure they have some some horchata, some agua de melon, agua de piña. Tu sabes. Make sure the green sauce food is this. Truck. Is what kind of ghetto shit is that? You think I'm at work? No, no I'm taking hey, you out to a restaurant. Yo. No, you don't have to do that though. I don't want you food to be truck. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna squat on the corner. Is that how they do it in LA? Or not LA, but Dallas. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Well, in they Dallas, have you motherfuckers are sitting on the streets eating. Yeah. Ooh, barbarianism. Uh, okay. Okay. Mm -mm. Uh, small talk has turned quite violent. I see <laughs> this rematch is as hot and heavy as people anticipated. It is your boy, Doctor Love Hands, stepping in. So we have gotten through the small talk portion, and I will be grading on small talk. But um, I feel as if though you know, Carmen didn't really get a chance to uh, say much because you know. Mantis, uh, you know, you were threatening her in certain ways, and most people in the chat are starting to feel uncomfortable. That's you know? flirting. That's flirting. <laughs> flirting <laughs> is war. That is correct. All right. So here we go, folks. It is time now to get into the first portion of the game. We're going to leave out. We'll just be going off the three to make sure it's easy. So now we're going to go into flirting with reckless abandon. So to make sure everyone gets a chance to talk, we're going to allow that person that I call on 
to flirt and have them flirt only. Okay. To flirt for exactly yeah. five minutes. This that that means nonstop flirting. Your best flirt lines. Your best oh my goodness. workplace flirts. Nonstop. Mantis is chugging a uh, forty ounce of old E, and he finished the whole week, so he's ready to go. Is is the chat ready for Mantis to kick off five minutes of nonstop flirting? That means Mantis will stop at ten one exactly. And three, two, one, flirt, Mantis. Baby, that shirt looks so good on you. It makes your tits look like pumpkins glistering on a full moon on a Halloween night. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Baby, I love that sarcastic smile you give me so much. It makes me dream of a time that pass. <laughs> Bail. <laughs> you are so sweet. I'm ready to just have all my teeth knocked out and just have dentures because they're going to have cavities for the rest of my life. <laughs> the way you humor me with your laugh well it gets me hard let me say it, put it like that <laughs> you are so utterly amazing that's pretty much it <laughs> you ready I think we just should skip this flirting and just go straight to the hanging out part wow. yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I think I have four more minutes, so here goes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Five minutes. Well, you are so amazing <sighs> that if you were to ever leave me, I'd have myself castrated and have it mailed to President Dictator Putin as a statement. Of how defeated I am, like a Ukrainian dog. That's it. That's the that's a compliment. Nothing. <laughs> you have no idea who those people or places are, do you? No. I know. <laughs> Give me something. Um. Uh, yeah. Um. You are so fantastic. I feel like I'm a hobbit. You know, like Lord of the Rings? Yeah. Lord of the Rings, the Hobbit. <laughs> you are so out of this world that I feel like I'm on Tempest 278B. That's an exoplanet. Oh. No, nothing. No, no nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Baby, you are so fire. It's like I strapped a stick of thermite to my ass and set it off until me and all my brittle bones melted into nothing. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I, I, I think honestly I'm gonna get further in this thing if I just like stare in the camera at you. <laughs> but it's weird because it's like a camera and not your eyes, you know what I mean? If I look at your eyes, it looks like I'm looking at your tits. If I look at the camera, it looks like I'm looking at your forehead, so it's totally weird. Okay. Okay. Um, um, the way you judge me is so titillating. I feel like I was in a 19th century burlesque show. <laughs> 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 baby you are so lovely that i am truly in love i am so blessed to be here with you and i'm so glad that the rowdy lunatics who we call our friends picked us to go on a date that's a compliment <laughs> thank you <laughs> I think I did so well. I'm just going to let the timer go down. You know what I mean? You did a great job. <laughs> Thank you. I can't wait to hear yours. I don't know if I have any. <laughs> uh, I, I, well, you used all your taco ones last time. So let's see. What <laughs> <you're doing. laughs> 
right. We're, we're going to let Mantis off the hook because nobody wants to sit here in silence for a minute. That's not what the people paid for. Um, <laughs> so we're going to save the grading until we have Carmen go because that's only fair. Uh, Carmen, I did send you a message on IG. So if you could just check that really quickly before you begin yours, we can continue it. And also, I just want to give a shout out to all 11 of you beautiful souls over here in uh, Twitch. If I could reach you, I would touch you with my Dr. Love hands and say thank you very much for being here. Remember to fan the page before you head out. Uh, man, this is my show, so I'm just going to go ahead and mute your mic. Uh, we don't need to hear from you for right now when I'm talking. Uh, Carmen, did you get my message? Yeah. All right. So it, it is exactly 1021 of the PM here on the East Coast. That means Carmen will go for five minutes and to 1026. Go ahead. Three, two, one. Flirt. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Bien. Qué bueno. Nomás quería decirte que, que a veces eh, me siento sola, no tengo a nadie, pero creo que si estás en mi lado, a lo mejor eso cambia. I know what you said, damn. <laughs> well, thank you. Do you, thank you. Do, you like, do you like spicy? In oh, your you life, know you know it. Well, I can spice your world up if you have me in your side for sure. <laughs> like, do you be my spice girl? Something like that. Um, la otra vez estaba pensando que a lo mejor eres la luna y el cielo de mi corazón. Pero a veces me siento de verdad sola. Tengo toda esta comida que quiero cocinar, pero no tengo a nadie. So, are you, are you open to come over here so I can make you some tacos? I am. <laughs> I absolutely am. Yeah, totally. It sounds um, like you said something about the moon. What about the moon? I say that you're the moon to my star. That, yeah. slick. that is some slick shit. So, you know, I like, I don't know if you know this, but I like sucking lollipops. <laughs> you hadn't mentioned that. <laughs> so, you know. Um, Even gargantuan lollipops? Yeah, the ones that have gum inside, you know? Yeah, no, but I mean the super duper ones that you have to go to a special candy store to get. Oh, yeah. Because they I don't like let little too. kids and only have them. Because that would be the situation. Yeah. Oh, man, this is not your time to talk. Uh, comment, can't continue. The people are feeling <laughs> spicy right now. Go ahead. I mean, if you let me, if you're down yeah. for it, you know, you, you you remind me of this whole meal that I just want to eat all the time, for sure. You seem like you're alone. Do you need me to come over? Because you know, I know that you probably live 15 miles away from me, but hey, if we're meant to be, we're meant to be, right? I don't know. Sometimes you gotta let the universe just floats, you know? <laughs> Hopefully you can come to Texas. We can eat some barbecue. I would like that. Or maybe take you to a place that I like to called life, a garden. <laughs> but, ¿sabes qué? Está bien. Yo te voy a decir algo. La verdad. Estás muy guapo. Me gustan tus ojos, tan verde. A veces miro tus ojos, me pienso como si estoy en el mar. Y... Eres simpático y sé que sabes bailar. Si tú sabes bailar, podemos bailar juntos. Just dance until the night. Until the sun comes up. For sure. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but my lips are very tender. And, you know, if we're willing, maybe we can make out or kiss sometimes. 
I mean, <laughs> if you're up to it. Um, yeah, I just want to say that I enjoy these couple of minutes talking to you, for sure. Oh, Carmen made it, used all her time, utilized it perfectly. So uh, we're going to let it, you know, calm down, let the steam blow oh, out of right. the room right now. Mantis's taco meat is showing, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so here we go. We are going to judge that first round. Uh, get ready for the tabulations. One, if Mantis won, drop a one in the chat if Mantis won. Or drop a two in the chat if Carmen won. Same thing on Twitch. No double voting, please. No double voting. <laughs> I, I, I am sorry, Mantis. You were defeated in that round. I know that you have strong feelings in the fact that Carmen has speaks the language of love, and you are only a Frenchman. And I do apologize for your proclivities as a Frenchman. So now we will move into what will obviously be an advantage round for you as a Frenchman. It is insulting each other based off of the first date. Now, I do have to remind you, I am on Twitch, so please refrain from saying anything that cannot be said on Twitch. But let's go ahead and uh, start the insults. And they say the insults are the lubricant of love in <laughs> you know, Romania. <laughs> so let's keep this going. Mantis will start. Remember, this is good fun, but insults based off of the first date. We were trading blow for blow, or do we have time? You're, you're, you're going first, and you will be going to exactly 1030. Um, just remember, they're making me do this. I, if I had to say anything, based <sighs> solely on a possible <laughs> criticism, but it doesn't mean I love you any less. You talk about tacos too much. That's <laughs> weird. <laughs> That's weird. Like every, even when it came to the flirting part, you're like, "Let me add tacos into the flirting," and I was just like. Does she live in a house made of tacos? That's this shit is weird. <laughs> All right. Oh okay. yeah. Um. Another thing I'd have to say. I mean, it's just so hard. You're so perfect. Um. But if I had to, if Doctor Love Hands is twisting my arm to criticize you, I'd say. That your smile is too perfect. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's no fun. You want me? You want me to hit, hit you hard? You want me to hit you hard? <laughs> <laughs> um, I would say that ultimately, you are a Texas hick who needs education and to stop bull riding and riding horses and doing whatever the hell you people down in Houston, Austin, or wherever you're from do boom i said it um i would also say that you i guess if i had to guess you smell like lavenders disgusting smell pretty good <laughs> that, that was not too bad man this i i was surprised that you were able to Swing from the fences like that. <laughs> okay. Carmen, it is exactly uh 1030. You have to 1033 to insult Mantis in every way, shape, or form you can think of <laughs> the last date or these brief interactions you've had right now. So uh go ahead and go. You know what? I'm glad you said something. You just insulted me about my tacos. I really don't appreciate that. So you know what? You here talking about tacos. You know what? You know, just because of doc, the doctor love, you know, I'm just going to tell you straight up and be honest with you. You're always talking about aliens. And to be honest with you, I really don't care. <laughs> I don't care <laughs> if you believe in aliens. I don't care. But you know what? 
over over overall i think that's the only thing that i can insult you <laughs> you're you seem perfect you know your eyes the way you talk you know about all these things comics you know but now you're over here talking about Texas. <laughs> you know what? I don't appreciate that. Um, like they say, everything is bigger in Texas and it is for sure. And you know Texas hat. <laughs> that is not a Texas hat. It's got a, a American flag on it. But that's not a Texas hat. Are you insulting the Texans? Uh, Mantis, I, this is the second time that I'm warning you. It's not your time right now. And also, Carmen, I caught that little rib about everything being bigger in Texas and smaller in Westchester. That was really good. Um, yeah, I don't know. It just kind of breaks my heart that you insulted Texas like that that we have something special going on but you're you're breaking my heart thought you could have go somewhere else but no you had to bring texas at least you could have brought something else instead of texas that. I'm, I'm sorry i mean this is not your game i guess <laughs> you, you're too sweet but we're going we're going to go ahead and go to the audience in the so let's start if you <laughs> Carmen had the better insults. Drop a one in the chat, and if no, I don't. had the better insults, drop a two in the chat. It looks like uh, Mantis has taken the game on this one. So we're tied up going into the last event. <laughs> Mantis, um, are you? Uh oh, wait a second. No, I won't let any sexism in tonight, ladies. You, you're not gonna put. You're not gonna rig the game tonight. You got your votes in too late. You should have came in earlier. <laughs> um, so now we're gonna we're, we're gonna go to the last event. It's time to close the deal. Listen. I'm going to tell you, this this date is almost on the same level as Izzy and uh, Kathy right now. You guys, are it, it, you're, you're dripping with love. We need steam for this last part. So it is exactly 10.33 now. Mantis, you need to close the deal in the next five minutes. Go. How you doing tonight, baby? You feeling good? You ready to do this? Because I wrote you a song. I did indeed. Baby, you are so beautiful. Because I'm so horny. So very horny. Girl, I just want to take you home. Slap that big old ass, get you undressed, make shit happen, make shit happen, make shit happen. I call that one Carmen. Oh, she's into it, guys. For some reason, she's muted. That's probably Dr. Love. He's a hater uh, doing that, but she is clearly into this right now. Here's what I'm saying. We got all these haters all over here. We got haters in the chat. We got people judging us. Who the fuck wants to be judged? Why don't you and me go back to my place? I don't have a hot tub, but I have a bathtub. Close enough. Close enough. Am I right, girl? Close enough. We get up in there. We use a bath bomb. Not one of those black ones. That wasn't racist. Not one of those black ones. <laughs> Regular bath bomb. Me and you, we make magic happen. <laughs> Don't give me that look. Don't give me that look. I know you're into it. Do 
girl. We've been playing too many games right now. You're sweet playing the sweet game when I know you're a nasty freak and you just want to let it out. I know that for a fact because I see it in your eyes. See these magical, beautiful eyes? They were meant to read your eyes. I know what's going on in your heart. You're not some sweet Christian girl. You're like, oh, my God, I just want to read the Bible and do whatever. Eat tacos. No, there's more to you than that. And I want to find out every inch of it. Baby, let me bring you on a tour. A tour of love. You ain't ever going to regret it. And just to let you know, I've been compared to a gorilla before. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> There's nothing like some silverback propositions. It was absolutely delightful, Mantis. Uh, Carmen, you're going to have to unmute your mic. I, in, in spite of the accusation, I did not mute you. You muted yourself, and I can't unmute you. So just go ahead and unmute your mic. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Now, we're going to have Carmen go. Wait, we're just going to give her a second because if you don't know, Carmen has a very high calling in life where we have to let her do that. So she'll get extra points for that. I know that's going to drive Berlin crazy, but moms get extra points. How's everyone doing tonight? How's everyone doing? 1-800-235-DEAD. Oh my goodness, Mantis, people are so turned on by the things you were saying in the chat. It said, it's a public literally just jumped out a window because public was so turned on by it. You're oh, there we go. Good. All right, Carmen. It is 1030. Okay. You have until 1042 to use the language of love to close the deal. But here's okay. anything said in Spanish has to be translated in English. So got you. Close the deal, Carmen. So I'm just going to be honest with you. I'm going to be straightforward. I have a schedule, a tight schedule as being a mom. And I mean, I don't mind going to McDonald's. We don't have to go to somewhere fancy restaurant. Si tu quieres, it's really up to you, you know. Um, yeah, I really, I mean, if you are that guy, the guy that I've been looking for, the guy that just gets my heart, just seeing you, even like brights up my day. If you're that guy, then maybe you should give it a try, you know? Um, yeah, I'm not really good at doing these things. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know. <laughs> Say it in Spanish, Carmen. Everything sounds good in Spanish. Please. Get, I out mean, here, get out of here, Dr. Love. <laughs> Trying to be I alone. The voice is la verdad. Um, I don't know. <laughs> well, it just takes me a while. Disculpa. Perdón. Um, if you like strawberries, we could come over at my house and we can eat strawberries with whipped cream. We can take it to my bed. Yo te lo doy en tu boca y tú me la das en mí. Si quieres, podemos poner whipped cream en todo el cuerpo. You can kiss me. O si quieres, si te gusta chocolate, también podemos hacer chocolates con fresa. Si yo miro que la cita se está yendo bien, entonces te voy a llevar a mi cama. Y tú sabes, vamos a hacer cositas muy bonita. Translate, say, if you want, we can eat strawberries with chocolate, strawberries with whipped cream. You know, then one might take you to my bed. And we can kiss and put whipped cream all over our body. I, if you like. I, I knew that because you were. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. And then we just wake up. Nos levantamos en la mañana. Si quieres, yo te hago desayuno en la cama. Translate, if you want, I can make breakfast when we wake up. You know? Um, yeah. You can stay bed all night, watch Netflix and chill. If you want, it's really up to you. I'm down for anything. And yes, you're right. I am a freak. I just let you find out for yourself. <laughs> yes. I'm very convinced to me, bright red over here. <laughs> All right, folks, here we are. And now the mystery round. So listen, I know that the game is rigged and that oh, the uh, females stick together. I found out the other day, Mantis, that they were secretly messaging each other. They get drunk with power and then they just give up the whole game. So we're going to give Mantis one more opportunity to close the deal. Mantis, I want you to pretend as if you were trying to make an ex-girlfriend jealous with Carmen. Bring that good old fashioned make my ex jealous game. And you close this mother. You close this mother all the way down. Go ahead, brother. You got to four ten forty five. Baby. I see the way you've been looking at me. And I heard those sweet Spanish sounds coming out your mouth. And I'm thinking, why is a woman so beautiful making so much noise? There ain't no reason to be talking right now. We need to be using those mouths for other things. You know what I mean? So why don't you and me get out of here? See these hoes over here? They ain't got nothing on you. That's why I'm talking to your beautiful ass. Me and you, we're going to get out of here. We're going to go something special. I know some creep or the former me, the old mantis was talking about jacuzzis or bathtubs or slutty shit but really i just want to take you for a drive along the shore go out to a place where we can watch the moon and we can cuddle for a while 45 minutes 50 minutes at most before we get for our freak on but it's going to be real romantic it's going to be real slow okay you feeling this and yo i know the thing is is that you're a masseuse and all day, you're rubbing other people. Well, this time, I'm going to be rubbing you from top to bottom. I'm going to make every inch of your body feel good until I head back up. You know where I'm angling at, girl. Let's do this. Like I said, we got all these haters and weirdos. The world is against us. Let's find love in a hopeless place. Me and you. Fuck the haters, just me and you. And whatever you want. You want strawberries? You want whipped cream? You're too busy as a mom. You want quickies during the day? That's what you're angling at? Then I'm your motherfucker. The fat mantis right here. Fat mantis and Carmen. Let's just seal this deal right now. Because everything else, everything before this is a prelude. It's a game. But me and you, are the real fucking deal. <laughs> oh, no. <coughs> All right, sorry. <laughs> Come on, TA, and you know, I get stuck in the wrong places. Um, that was actually really fucking good, man. That was like, that was like Leonidas on the top of that hill, throwing that long spear at a half-dressed naked man. Who pretended to be a demigod? Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, about that. I was reading from the wrong script. I will get back to the show. Um, so we gave Mantis his second opportunity. I think he made the best of it. But seeing as how the game was rigged for the past few weeks, we're going to take the hands power out of the hands of the voters for just a second, and we're going to ask Carmen an honest question. Carmen, did Mantis win that round? Yes, he did. Okay. <laughs> so with that said, that was the, the last round. It is tied going into this. 
Now, let's go ahead and let the chat vote. If Carmen won this day, drop a one in the chat. Pubs and D, would you mind tabulating for me? Okay. Okay. If Mantis won this day, drop a two in the chat. That's brave. Who is the winner? Be in public. Okay, we got five for Carmen. How many did we get for Mantis? I, I, you know, I did not show up to take the GED test. I drove by the building, but I did not go in. <laughs> Four for Mantis. Mantis, because of the shenanigans going on, you have unfortunately lost this day. But we're gonna ask Carmen. Carmen, did Mantis win this date? You be honest, Carmen. To be honest with you, I think he did. Okay, so Carmen's vote counts as two. Mantis will be advancing on to the next round. Carmen, we want to thank you for coming out and playing. You are a true competitor. You are a saxophone of love, but don't worry, you are not out the game, Carmen. I'm just thank moving you. you over to another position. I mean, wait, I'm moving you into a new position. Wait. I'm putting you up with someone else. Wait, she's dating other motherfuckers? <laughs> I'm separating you two. Nobody wants to see y'all fall in love. This is my game. I do what I want. I am God on this little hill called What love. if I fell in love on this day? What am I supposed to it do now? It doesn't matter how you feel. Uh, let me just put you on mute. I'm sorry. So, you're... <laughs> so as you know, Bex won her date last week, and Mantis has won his date by Carmen's omission. So you know who will be dating next. It will be a rumble in the jungle. Haiti versus America, and we will see who will come out on top. And uh, yes, that's right. Yep, that, yeah, that is. I, you know, don't you scream at me in my own goddamn chat. And Carmen, you know who you going out with, Carmen? He's the bane of Berlin's existence. His name starts with J. Just whisper it into the mic, and you say, Jeremy. Jeremy. <laughs> I have. <laughs> spoken that is the end let me unmute mantis he looks he's crying he looks very upset right now <laughs> who the Man. fuck is jeremy who well, the fuck is, is jeremy <laughs> you said his Ooh. name wrong you, you have to say jeremy i'm not gonna fucking play any games for this month <laughs> are you okay mantis it is a you I have done everything I could to help you, my brother. That was a hot and steamy round. Uh, Jeremy is waiting for Carmen in the Boom Boom room, and we will make sure they get the Boom Booms going. Um, how do you feel about your win tonight, Mantis? I'm going to fuck you up, <laughs> love hands. <laughs> Mantis broke his own camera. Carmen, how do you feel about your date tonight? Motherfucker. <laughs> That went pretty well. All right. Good. All right. So I will make sure I get you all set up with uh, with Jeremy. D, I originally brought Jeremy on for you, but someone paid me exactly $275.26 not to match you up with Jeremy. And this has been another great night of love. Carmen, you are a true champion. We obviously pitied Mantis and allowed him to move on to the next round. So thank you. Oh, he's back. Uh, you have a good night, Carmen. All right. Mantis, my brother, I love you. Thank you so much for doing this. Y'all jump over to the green room and I'll see you there. Twitch, thank you for coming through tonight. Uh, Mantis, you uh, you can leave now. Uh, I'm leaving, motherfucker. Give me a chance, <laughs> yo. I only got my... <laughs> and thank you, everyone, for sticking around. I will be over there in one second and we will discuss the date. All 13 of you. And remember, this is your last opportunity to, to go ahead and fan the page. We are on the path to affiliate please click that link if you haven't already fan me on twitch help your boy monetize his channel twitch i will see y'all all back at green room good night